You had no right. I had every right. I mean, seriously, it should be your religion on trial here, not me. You have no understanding of my religion. Well, I know he doesn't want us to be together. Look, Billy, OK, if it hadn't been me, it would have been somebody else. And that's your justification for stabbing me in the back? I did what you couldn't do, so... No, what you did was make me doubt myself, my congregation, my church. Oh, please, your church couldn't give a toss about you. One phone call was all it took, Billy. One. And that must make you so proud. Billy, look... I'm not the enemy here. Yeah, next you'll be telling me you acted out of love. But you need to set him free. You can't see this now, but down you the line... You think I'm free? You've turned my world inside out. Everything that gave my life purpose, anything that made sense is gone. We, we still make sense. That hasn't changed, has it? Everything has changed. Because of you, I'm as lost as I was ten years ago. That's not true, because ten years ago, you didn't have me. I wanted to hate you. I know, but that's not your style, is it? <laughs> eh? No. No, it's not. Pity is what I feel. Can we not, you know, say anything we're both gonna regret? You know, I always thought your... your lack of empathy was a defence mechanism. I thought that if I dug deep enough that I would find the real Todd. This is the real you. The real Todd in all his glory. So you're not going to give me a second chance? I mean, what would the big guy say, eh? He would say that I deserve better than you. Sorry I'm late, guys. I was unexpectedly delayed. Did you come on your own? No, no, there's a SWAT team waiting around the corner. Of course I came on my own. I think I stood you up? I thought I'd occurred. Well, you're here now. And right off the bat, I want to say on behalf of... Why don't we cut to the chase, yeah? TikTok and all that. I want in. I want in all the way. I'm not really feeling the love here, guys. Well, it's just a surprise and change of heart. Well, what can I say? I've missed the real me. We're supposed to just take your word. It's not very trusting your mate, is it? Trust is earned. I mean, try and see if my point of view, only yesterday, you reported us to the police. Yeah, and I came out of it looking like a right clown, didn't I? What, now you're just rolling over? Whoa, whoa, whoa. You said anything about rolling over. We haven't discussed the terms yet. Terms? You discuss terms? News to me. My family are off limits, OK? No matter what happens, me mum and Jason are taken care of. Oh, what? Well, you'll find out just how annoying I can be. Or we just kill you and take our chances. You'll have to forgive Vinny's sense of humour. Todd, you got a deal? Cool. So, ripping off friends and neighbours, not a problem? Not me friends. And I've never been what you call neighbourly. In fact, if they're gullible enough to swallow your sales pattern, deserve to be fleeced. Now, that's not very Christian. What's the boyfriend gonna say? No, doesn't matter what he says. He's not my boyfriend. Since when? Since he found out I'm a lying, manipulative creep. In other words, you're a perfect salesman. What will he tell your mum? I'll think of something. So, we good? We're good. OK. Best decision you've ever made. <laughs>